An example of how I address mental load with my wife before she's about to go for a six day trip. Leaf blower edition. Alyssa is about to go away for six days on a personal development immersion experience. Desire on Fire tagged if you want to know more. One thing she told me this morning, she wanted to get a grocery order in before she goes. And she really wants a leaf blower. This is our first fall living at this house. And it's a lot more land than we're used to. We were debating on getting an electric or a gas blower and definitely want a backpack one. After discussing this last night, I probably looked for about 20 minutes on Lowe's as I have a Lowe's gift card. This morning, I pointed out to her, hey, I know we started that conversation last night. I know you'd really Really like to have the Leafs managed this week and you're gonna be gone for six days and I'm happy to do it while you're gone. It also feels like you have a strong desire to choose the one that we get. I know that you want a backpack. I know you want a gas one. I'm happy to make the executive decision and I'll plan to do that unless you say otherwise. And furthermore, here's what I want to point out about the way that I languaged that. I identified the need, gave her the feedback reminding her that I remembered what she said. Three, I put forth a plan of action saying I would handle it. And as I had the feeling that she wanted to do it herself, gave her the space to jump into that if she wanted to. This creates a multiple choice question with a pre-circled answer. If you're trying to take mental load off your partner, this is how you do it. And note, a younger me would have said, hey, Alyssa, what do you want to do about the leaf blower? Hi, my name's Zach. I'm a recovering man child. Hi, Zach. I work directly with men to improve their skills around this. Book a relationship goals console if you want to see if you might be the right fit for one of the courses that I have coming up.